Hey guys, it's Sean of StayFitBuzz.com here. Now, today I'm going to show you an example of the Zeus workout. The Zeus workout is similar to the, to the Aphrodite workout in that it's four days a week training. But the difference is that with the men's, we're going to use four different training styles for each of the four days. Now, today I'm going to show you an example of Tuesday's workout. Uh, this is how that's going to go. We're going to do 12 reps, two sets. We're going to use the, the FitBuzz Super Rep. We're only going to take a minute and a half between each set, we're going to go heavy, um, and between each and the rest of the periods, we're only going to take a minute and a half rest there as well. Remember, we're going to go heavy. Now today, I'm only going to show you um, using light weights. I've got the dumbbells here, and we're going to do three exercises. We're going to start with a squat, then we're going to switch to the pull-up because it's going to work the upper body and give your lower body a rest, and then we're going to go back and do the dumbbell deadlift. So let's get into it. So, let's start with the squat. So, as many of you may know, with the squat, with dumbbells, you've got to position your arms a little bit different. So when you lift these up, if you rest on your shoulders. So, if you don't know what the, what the Fit Bar Super Rip is, let me show you. It's when you count down to five, to the bottom of the move. Now remember, it's 12 reps and two sets. And remember, you're going to go heavy. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five. 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 Now that's just with light weights, and that one set is draining. And another thing we don't do on this workout on Tuesday, we don't train to failure. You make sure you always get the 12 reps in every single time. Have a little rest. And again, like I said in the other video, make sure you're fully hydrated. Keep your bottle of water near. There's no drifting off. To the side. You're going to be out of breath on this one, I can assure you. But you're only going to have a minute and a half. Remember, this is just light weights, but you are going to go heavy. It's a, it's a day where it's maximum effort. You go all out. You go all out. I say this is lightweight. I can have a little bit of a, a, sh a shorter rest, so let's get into it. Let's get back into set number two.
and that's your two sets done. Now, once you go a little bit heavier than that, you are going to need, you're definitely going to need a two minute rest. Um, the design of this workout is, you know, the whole premise of this workout is that it's a high frequency workout. Instead of it being long, it's short. And that's the, that's the difference. Most high frequency workouts are long. So, we've only got two minutes to rest, like you all have. So the next thing we're going to do, we're going to do weighted pull-ups. Uh, pull-ups or chin-ups, whatever the variation is. Today we're going to do chin-ups. But you're going to do weighted, and again, you're going to use a Fitbar Super Rep. The Fitbar Super Rep. Um, the Super Rep is a way that builds tension, and because of, this, because of the start of this workout, um, it's great for, to add that to this workout because it helps build muscle and obviously um, increase strength as well. Um, but mostly building muscle, this is mostly a day for muscle building. Remember, there's four different styles, and you do one on each of the days. So now let's get into our chin ups. Um, our weighted chin ups. We've had nearly our two minute rest there. It seems really short, and it is. There's only four, there's only four exercises in every single workout. Alright, so now for most of you, you wouldn't be using a dumbbell in between your legs. You would be using a uh, weighted belt, but you can use a dumbbell, it's up to you. Uh, they work, they work as well, just as, they work just as well. Just remember that if you are going to use a dumbbell, use uh, the weighted belt. When you go heavy, be careful because you will mess up. You can mess up your lower back. You will feel it, you will feel the pull on your lower back and the and the, the bottom of your waist. Uh, that's where uh, a dumbbell could be useful. So uh, Let's get into our uh, second exercise. This is used to work out. It's going to knock you out. This I can assure you. Not many people train like this. But this is the road that's less travelled. And it's the road that will yield the best results. Um, I'll be doing this workout um, alongside you. And I'll be showing my progress pictures in the same time period as well. I can assure you, you will definitely need your two minute rest for this. This part of the, this part of the workout. I remember, I haven't added any heavy weights yet. But remember, this is a high frequency workout that I would have prepared you for. Don't do this workout if you're not prepared for it. It will knock you out. Got a few more seconds left. Before we uh, get back into set number two. Woo! Alright. Here we go.
like that, you do two things. You find someone to help you, or you go all out, or you just drop the dumbbell and do the last couple of reps without the dumbbell. That's just fine, that's just fine. Because what you'll find is, what you'll find is that as the beats go on, you become stronger. And those last two reps that you struggle to do, you'll find you're able to do them. So now let's get to the last exercise, the dumbbell deadlift. Remember, this exercise, this workout is only, it's only four exercises long. So uh, the last one we're going to do is the uh, dumbbell deadlift. Dumbbell deadlift. Now, uh, the dumbbell deadlift, it's a little bit different. You hold your, uh, your hands more to uh, at a 45 degree angle instead of right in front of you. So uh, once again, we're going to use a fit by super rep. We count. We count on the on the way up, way down. So we've got a few more seconds to start. Yeah, it's intense, it's brutal. I can assure you. At the end of this 28 days, you're going to see some changes. Here we go. We've only got one more, one more set to go. Yeah, it's pretty intense. And uh, I'm pretty much only using body weight, to be honest. I mean, these aren't that heavy. But you don't have to go heavy straight away. I mean, as long as you've got some sort of weight on the dumbbells or on whatever the exercise tells you to do, and you'll be all right. Uh, so I'm not using any heavy weights, let's go back into it.
and that wraps it up for the sample. Um, again, the key, put, the key standouts for this is that you're going to only take a minute and a half to maybe two minutes rest between sets. Um, and the same between each exercise. The key thing is to keep the momentum going. It's a non-stop, brutal affair, and that's, uh, that's basically the premise of this workout. You use a Fitbar Super Rep where the, uh, where the program tells you to use them. We're not going to use them on every single um, on every single workout or every single day. It doesn't make sense, as each single day is designed differently to uh, produce a different result. But that's the uh, example. But if you want results, again, you're going to walk the road less traveled, and that's what the Zeus workouts are all about. You should be lucky, the women have it harder, they've got more exercises. But yeah, until the next video, keep working hard and prepare for results.